My name is uh, Joshua, and I became a chef because the zigzagging, unpredictable path of life brought me to be one. <laughs> I just, I just like looking at an ingredient and being like, okay, what is gonna just elevate this already fantastic ingredient just a little bit? I'm not trying to, to hide its flavors. I'm not trying to make it something that it's not. I'm just trying to help lift it up just a little bit more. Um, so, and asparagus is one of my favorite ingredients. So, uh, uh, um, especially in Iowa, like th th this is the best asparagus I've ever had anywhere in the world is here. I mean, there's some really good stuff in Italy too, but but. Iowa asparagus is actually something very special. When we decided to do this, we knew like the, the success rate like percentage was probably like 10 to 15 percent. Like we knew we knew this was would probably not work, but we decided like we're gonna do something that we believe in and that we think is really cool and we're just gonna do it. And we knew, like, we knew what we wanted to do and what we wanted to put forth, and that was create an atmosphere that was super fun and enjoyable, where people could come in here, drink good beer, good wine, local beer, eat local food that's done in kind of a rustic, old-timey fashion with a little bit of elevation to it, and just have a good time. And so that's what we wanted to do, and, and I think we've done that. And I think any time that you go forward in life and put all the, be like, this is too risky, I, I can't do this, like, like, just take that leap. Like, like you might fail, but you know, you, your character only gets built by failure. And I've failed at plenty of things, and you never know, this place could fail tomorrow too, but life goes on, and I think when something is built out of that fearless, kind of relentless passion, that it's special, and I think, I think that just reverberates through the place. Mm -hmm.